theater in the battle for the supremacy of talent and profile. The championship of the world, the NBA crown. Once upon a time, basketball's vibrancy was imagined. And then we started dropping dimes and getting above the rim. And feeling ourselves, because we got game. Thank you, Clyde, Wilt, Kareem, Dr. J. Thank you for the froze, the suits, the short shorts, long shorts, the tats, and it's got to be the shoes. Facts. What every player, coach, and hometown fan hopes for every season, a shot at the NBA World Back to back. Yeah. Yeah. Magic. Dr. J. Big fella. Derek. Hakeem. Tim. Kareem. Larry Bird. The logo. Let's go! Come into my house, where a devoted congregation will call upon and behold. Legends shape the here and now and the dream to win it all. Very well. It's the NBA Finals. Once again for the Phoenix Suns and the Milwaukee Bucks. Game four of the NBA Finals presented by YouTube TV. This city has gone mad for these Bucks. Dreaming of a championship would be the first one in 50 years. And also the new place to be, the Deer District, right outside the Pfizer Forum. The loyal, passionate Buck fans exploding on Sunday night as their team got into the in the wind column. Meanwhile, Chase Field back in Phoenix. A watch party for the Suns. They can't wait to have their team return home. Will it be 3-1 or will it be all tied up at 2-2? And speaking of championships, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar winning the NBA Finals MVP back when he was known as Lou Alcinda. One of the all-time greats and one of the all-time greats was his teammate for that championship team. The only championship in the history of the Milwaukee Bucks. There's John McLaughlin as well, part of that, that team, walking in front of the great Big O. As we take a look at our starting line. dominance even shot free throws superbly well in game three it has been fun mark jackson to watch him again we didn't know if he was even going to play again after that injury in the conference finals but he is returned with gusto just putting on an incredible all-time great performance when you think about a minute ago we didn't even know if he was going to play in the finals his toughness his competitive spirit and his willingness to come to play hurt and be on the front line is inspiring Meanwhile, Chris Paul in his first finals started off with an absolute gem in game one. Uh, he wasn't up to his usual standard in game three. And he said he didn't sleep much that night. Watched the entire game, talked with Devin Booker as they look to make some adjustments.